Welcome to Boxland, population one, me. Uh, look, me and Em are in the next uh, couple of weeks going to be moved into the new property, fingers crossed. The internet was sorted out last week, so it's pretty much an easy move over, but there's a lot of stuff that still needs to go. And I'm in Manchester uh, at the weekend, so a lot of things are happening, and I want to get this video done and out to you as soon as possible. If you don't want to watch the video, go and check out the guide and the link in the description. It's the SideQuest guide. It has been updated on a regular basis. As soon as I get any available time, I am adding stuff to it. Uh, of course, Rome wasn't built in a day, and it hasn't been in a week since uh, content was, uh, was out. So I'm trying my best, working hard. Uh, so thank you very much for all those kind words and messages that I receive uh, about, you know, uh, go Rich go thanks for the enthusiastic stuff anyway right to the point let's get into the video okay uh start off with the objective number one you've probably done this x23 it's important to get these objectives done because you get codes and hints in how, how to uh to kind of get the uh, murder box opened now doing those objectives very easy the first one and rotor labyrinth is going to play a part in this uh this quest today if you've got yourself a x23 just quickly, you've probably, as I said, you've probably done this. Running in Arena, very easy, just going in using Wolverine X23. If you haven't done it yet, right, I'd recommend going doing some of the lower arenas, the Catalyst Clashes when they, they pop up, and also some of the Trials. Just run those lower difficult lower versions of X23 in those lower pieces of arena. Uh, even with a like, you know going with a four star in I don't really know. It's a bit iffy to say going in these basic and seven star operating arenas with four star versions. I think I did it once and it wasn't particularly. I did it, but it was a bit hairy and scary. A five star version and a six star version would be better suited to doing these particular ones here, uh, leaving your four star, three star, and two star version if you've got one in some of the trials or indeed Catalyst Clash. Make sure in, in, to ask for help in order to do that. Right, let's move on to the next one. The next one is using or losing with uh, with champions that are mentioned here. So winning or losing with Miss Marvel, Kamala Khan, Mark Chavez, Squirrel Girl. So in a nutshell, sorry, Squirrel Girl in a nutshell. Great, well done, Rich. If you use these champions in content, just lose. Um, that's that's basically it. If you want to go up against a Miss Marvel Kamala Khan, go and head to Road to Labyrinth. Go to 4.4. Uh, As I said, you don't have to do this. It's it's optional. You can either do the losing or you can do the winning. It will depend on how many volume. Like at the point of recording this video and also putting it out, you won't you won't know what the objective number is. Like, do you have to do it ten times? You do it ten times, and of course it's going to cost you. Uh, energy, so you might have to run this in a road, road to Labyrinth 1.1, but in 4.4 there is a Kamala Khan. If you go into the quest and go on for three energy, uh, there will be a Kamala Khan, which you're going to see, boom, right there. So it's an option. I'm not saying you do or don't have to do it. We like to provide you options. Hey, so go do uh, the thing with that, that if you so choose. Losing fights using or win fights against. So lose fights against. Win fights against Kamala Khan. That there. Go do it. I think that's today's one. That'll be today's one. And then next next Wednesdays, you can and to the end of this particular event, you can run a lot of stuff in 1.1. So in 1.1, you can use Spider-Man to defeat a hashtag hashtag robot robot. Oh, I can't honestly can't speak today for some reason. So go against his robot robot. Uh, Vision Age of Ultron with Spider-Man. Boom. Repeat the quest multiple times. One energy spend. Easy as that. There's also similar thing with use Spider-Man again. Wolverine, Cyclops, Blue Team, right? Or Shocker or hashtag Robot Tag Champion in any game mode. Like use Spider-Man and run it through there. Just because it's easy. It's easy, just just do that. It's one energy spent. Roll it again and again and again. I don't know if incursions will work with it for zero energy spend. Or arena, maybe. Um, but that's up to you. If you want to use them arena, do it. Or road to labyrinth, just auto fight it and through. It's a pretty easy standard thing. There you go. Low energy spend for that. Final one. X-23, Squirrel Girl, Spider-Man, Wolverine, Cyclops, Blue Team, or Gambit to defeat Arcade or any get in or in, in any game mode, uh, excluding practice mode. This is a bit more of a trickier one. Now, I don't know, at the point of recording this video, if that, by the end of the month, we have seen side quests which have Arcade in it. 
So in the Terra Twister, there could be in multiple weeks, in those multiple weeks, you may see it, you may not. There may be an arcade in there. I, I'm not 100% uh, certain on that one. We'll have to see uh, down the line. But if you're looking for other options, because there's not, it doesn't seem to be a dual target unless one pops up, we'll, we'll of course let you know if there's an easier one uh, like there. I would recommend either number one, going into something like Contender and running it multiple times on Delete Your Saves, um, Proven, whatever it is, just get to the end boss and run it multiple times. It depends on how many times you have to defeat Arcade in order to get it. Or what you could do, depending on the difficulty you're doing, you might be like, well, I'll leave the last one, delete your saves, and put in my team either an X-23, a Squirrel Girl, a Spider-Man, a Wolverine, a Cyclops, Blue Team, Storm, or Gambit, and basically do the last 1%, get the enemy champion down to 1%, bring in the other one, finish off Arcade, boom, you've got yourself the objective done. Again, we're just giving you some options right here, and if there's better ones out there, then of course I'll, I'll revamp and change the uh, the objectives guide uh, to uh, refer to that and reference that in the future. So yeah, that's been my top tips for the objectives, and uh, good luck in the coming weeks of these dropping. Do bear in mind they drop on a weekly basis, and form the basis of giving you those uh, those hints. Hints gives you codes. Codes open murder boxes. Good luck indeed with opening up that murder box because. Oh, it's murder in a box. Anyway, thanks for watching. Check out some other content located on screen. I'll see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.